children, never mind swearing, they're hitting their own parents. Ma'azallah, they are hitting their own parents. And we were on a Madani Kafila in Leeds. And we brothers were sitting in the Madani Halka. And this 60 year old father, old man, he walked inside the masjid. And he saw the young lads who were sat in the Madani Halka. He comes up and he starts crying just like a baby. He was crying loudly. We were all go worried. So we stood up, we went to the Buzurg and we said, Babaji, is everything okay? What's wrong? Why are you crying for? And the Babaji, he says that by looking at you, I feel so happy. You know, your parents are so lucky. Your parents are so good that Alhamdulillah, their children are in the masjid. Every day I have an argument with my son and he wants drug money. Just now coming to the masjid, he robbed me, he hit me, he pushed me out of the house and he stole 300 pounds for me just to buy drugs. Can you imagine these children who are doing this to their parents? What do they think they are? What do they think that they're achieving? The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, we've heard the famous hadith. Paradise lies in your mother's feet. Your mother makes dua for you, you will enter paradise. Look at Bayazid Bistami radiallahu ta'ala anhu. Such a very high ranked buzurg of his time. Bayazid Bistami radiallahu ta'ala anhu. He went out in search of Allah Azza wa Jal. He says to his mother, please forgive me all your rights because I want to go and search for the mercy of Allah. I need to go and search, do the zikr of Allah, just remember Allah. I don't want anyone in my life apart from Allah. So please forgive me your rights. The mother, she says, Bayazid, I forgive you all my rights. And Bayazid Bistami radiallahu ta'ala anhu, he left Bistam in search of Allah Azza wa Jal. He went from one city to the other city, one jungle to the other jungle. And every time he would do the zikr of Allah Azza wa Jal. Two years later, by Yazid Bistami radiallahu ta'ala anhu, he came back to Bistam. And when he came back to his own village, he thought that now it's time that I can go and see my mother, just to see how my mother is. As he went outside the house, it was the time of Fajr. By Yazid Bistami radiallahu ta'ala anhu, he saw water flowing into the, in, in, into the drains. And he realized that it must be my mother, she, was, she will be doing wuzu. And then when he went inside, he saw that his mother was, uh, was, uh, was sitting on the Jai Namaz on the Musalla. And she was making dua. And the dua was that, Ya Allah, my son Bayazid has gone in search of you. Ya Allah, he wants your rahmat. He wants your mercy. He's looking for your love. Oh Allah, grant my son Bayazid your love. Be happy with him. I am pleased with my son. When Bayazid he heard this dua of his mother. He went inside and he fell into the feet of his mother. And he says, Ya Allah, for two years I've been looking for you in the jungles. But Ya Allah, I found you in the dua of my mother. That is what your mother and father are. Your mother and father are the gateway to paradise. Your mother and father, if they are pleased with you, then Allah is pleased with you. If you see that your mother and father are not pleased with you, then think to yourself, your ibadat on one side, your hajj on one side, your every ibadat on one side. Paris Islam, you are never going to achieve anything in this dunya. You might be the biggest businessman living here. You might be so famous. People will come and respect you. But if your parents are not talking to you, if your parents are not happy with you, then think that Allah Ta'ala is not happy with you as well. Always be obedient to your parents. Be mindful and understand that your parents are everything for you. Love and respect your parents.